Okay, so in this demonstration we're going to show how to use categories in OM9. Categories are a really useful feature where we can deploy scripts that only go onto machines that are running policies which have been associated with a certain category. So I'm going to start off by creating a category. So to do that, we go into the admin interface, we go to edit, add category, I'm going to call the category my category. So I'm going to call it my category. And then we've got an option here. We can tell it to create the category directories. So I'm going to allow it to do that. So click save. Okay, so now if I want to view the category directory structure, I can click on the view category directory structure link, um, and you can see that it's created two folders, Unix and Windows. So what you can do is you can drill down through um, each of these folders, and then you can create platform-specific scripts. So for example, anything that can run to go on any Unix platform will go on the Unix folder, Anything that can go on a Windows system can go on the Windows system. And when you go into these folders, you can further drill down to make it a more specific match. So, for example, you might have a different script for Windows 2003 to 2008. The location of these folders on the management server in var opt ov share. So I'll just actually copy that out so you can see it. Copy. put it in here. So that's the location of where, where, where the, the folders are going to be. So it's var opt ov share database management node instrumentation my category. Okay next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to create a policy which I want to associate with that category. So I do that by going to edit add policy I'm going to keep it a simple, I'm just going to create a message type policy. I'm going to call it my Windows message type policy. Um, okay. Give it its default options. 